Hello and welcome to my tutorial about Git and VS Studio 2013. Man, most of the people don't know that Microsoft VS Studio 2013 has also a direct support to the Git. Like you don't have to use uh, some uh, software like uh, 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 Tortoise Git or something to first copy your code into some other folder and then put it on the repo. It's an easier way. So jump right into it. First of all, I would create a new project and um, maybe I would name it git test okay and we'll make an empty project finish and now it's asking the option choose the source control for the new project you have to select here the git not the team foundation version control that's for the Microsoft built-in uh, version control and it is on their website and it's not so good as much as I have checked it so get we have to check the get now I would add some source file of C++ and add. so I would run it and show you how it is now how I could uh, save the whole project in git you have to go in this team connect to the team viewer foundation and uh, can go to this home place and there you have changes because you have changed the project you see there are automatically added these files okay and there is no untried files or excluded files so what would I do I would commit it here like I would say the commit name initial commit I would put in the comments and I am going to commit and push now it's asking about the remote repository where we are going to put the git uh, repo so i go to here the github.com and i will make a new repository and make this repository uh, git test okay and create it now it's giving me an http address i would copy it and paste it in here okay and now publish it it's now publish and also goes to sync now it's complete now as we move to my this git repo and reload it you see i have the initial commit and this is the file i have been using because it's an initial commit so there are no changes in the file but uh, now i would change like a little change i am changing my name to complete name and save it and try to run it another time so now what would i do i go to home i go to changes and there is a, it has sense that the source file has been changed i would call it the second commit <coughs> and now i would again commit and push now it would commit it and also the push it to the master and now when we go to back to the home and reset reload it you see there is a second comment and second comment just a source file is changed so uh, I have deleted this line and added this line okay so there is uh, my short tutorial on how to use git with the Microsoft Visual Studio 2013 if you like it please uh, uh, like this and also uh, subscribe my channel thank you